Travel is nearly at pre pandemic levels and today was supposed to be one of the busiest days of the holiday, but a lot of people today told me that it was smooth sailing. Even so, there were some hiccups. Here I am 13 hours later. A rough start to the holiday for some. The FAA says a Delta flight from Rochester to Boston forced to make an emergency landing. The cockpit filled up with smoke and the pilot were, pilots were unable to uh, continue the flight, so we had to uh, go back to Rochester. It was a rough day. But driving may not be any easier. AAA says more than a million people in Massachusetts will hit packed roads. Traffic could be up roughly 30% on parts of 95 and the pipe and up 76% of parts of I-93 South. We see a lot of pent up demand for travel. There are people who are traveling this year that were hunkered down during the entire pandemic. That was super easy. Carolyn Fist just happy to finally fly after being forced to drive for the holidays during COVID. It got me home and like kept my family safe, but I didn't enjoy it. AAA expects four and a half million Americans to fly for Thanksgiving, up nearly 8% over last year, but travelers have haven't felt it yet. Just getting through, you know, into the terminal was was crazy. The traffic was really backed up, but once we got inside, it was fine. Yeah, we'll see what happens on Sunday when we fly home. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that might be a what different story. Sunday? A lot of traffic now here at Logan and Sunday will also be one of the busiest times on the road from 8 to 8. Live at Logan, Sean Shire about WCVB News Center 5.